I had gotten up to 225 pounds, and it was the most I had ever weighed in my adult life. I didn't like being 225. That is so nasty. I've never been 225, and I've, I've lived my adult life and certainly my professional career in brilliant, muscular yeah. condition. What's going on everyone? It's Cecile Suede and in this video I am going to be attempting Will Smith's extreme weight loss diet for a day. So earlier this year during the end of lockdown, Will Smith posted an Instagram picture with the caption, I'm going to be real with y'all. I'm in the worst shape of my life. He says in the worst shape of his life. This post got more than 6.7 million likes and he's actually about to start a fitness transformation series with YouTube documenting his body transformation. Smith teaming up with YouTube to share his his transformation set to debut in 2022. Being 52 years old and taking on this challenge, I really applaud him. And I think it's going to help so many people out there get out of their lockdown physiques, right? And get into the best shape of their lives. But with that being said, this diet is going to consist of almost 1800 calories coming from four clean meals. It's actually super strict, tons of clean meals. And there's a couple principles and philosophies that I'll share with you all in just a moment with what he's going to be following the next few months to lose almost 50 pounds. All right, but look, if you enjoyed this, make sure you smash the like button right now. I would genuinely appreciate it. Let's run it up and I'll see you all in the kitchen with some tips, tricks, and food. Friends and family, so I have gathered all of the foods needed for Will Smith's extreme weight loss diet. So this is going to be very specific on exactly what kind of meals he's following, right? It's gonna be four clean meals. The first meal is going to be breakfast, which is gonna consist of quick oats and whole eggs. And then the second meal is going to be pre-workout, which is gonna include an assortment of supplements here, which I'll show you all later in this video. And then the third meal is going to be a late lunch consisting of chicken and broccoli. And then of of course, the fourth meal is going to be dinner, which is gonna be steak and sweet potatoes. Oh my God, or shall I say, bro my God. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started with cooking meal number one, which is gonna be breakfast. So I just got done preparing meal number one, which is going to be Will Smith's breakfast. And of course he did not let us down. He did not let the bro in me down. We have four whole eggs with some oatmeal, just oatmeal, literally, that's it. I wish it were proatmeal or something. If this were me, it'd be proatmeal and like two eggs and some egg whites. But hey, it's Will Smith, well, it is me. But all right, listen up, this is extremely important. I just wanna ask you all a very, very important question. So I was blown away at the feedback when I asked you all this in my last video, but I wanna ask you guys again, just to really make sure if I want to commit to this or not, but would you guys want to see me create a bro cookbook where I include recipes and exactly how to make meals just like you're watching in these videos and just my favorite bro recipes, right? These are so easy and I'm even going to make it a little bit funny, you know, call chapters like one night stand snacks, booty call breakfast. I mean, you know, embarrassingly quick one pump chomp recipes. Let me know in the comment section down below. If I see hundreds of comments on you guys wanting to actually buy a cookbook like this, I'll create one. So just please comment down below. Give me feedback. Back and I'll get to it immediately. Anyways, let's go ahead and just like tank this. Gotten so used to just eating one whole egg at a time. Like, maybe become an absolute sauvage, just do this. That's the best thing. So, we're gonna see the best for last. We're going with the plain broat meal. Hot, 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 hot. Oh, it's so thick and plain. I like my moment thick, but not plain. Good if I like my oatmeal. This is so hot, it's burning my insides. All right, ready? Let's try this. Yes, I just dropped ice cubes in my oatmeal. We're gonna see if this actually does something to cool this down. Okay, I'm not supposed to eat the ice, but screw it. That does help, kind of. Okay, we're just gonna let this wither away a bit. Don't ever do that. 
honestly great meal until I put the ice cubes in the oatmeal. Should have just kept it plain. But anyways, that is going to wrap up breakfast. So next up is actually going to be all about supplementation. It's just in terms of what he's going to be taking every single day for his weight loss journey. I'm going to tackle supplementation a little bit because I always get questions on tons of comments on what kind of supplements that I personally use, you know, what I think other people should be using. So I'll tackle that while showcasing what he personally uses in his diet. All right, so I've got all the supplements laid out that the specific article on Will Smith's Extreme Weight Loss Diet mentioned that he is using. It literally says, Will Smith uses the following supplements to help fuel his gain. So I'll run through it step by step. So it says BCAs, boom. We have our essential BCAs. All of it is by my protein, of course, which is the most budget-friendly supplement brand that you will ever find, guaranteed. And then it says whey protein. We've got the Impact Whey Protein Powder, fruity cereal flavored, which is my absolute favorite. Favorite, again by my protein and then we also have a multivitamin boom just a simple men's multivitamin and we also have pre-workout so that's it guys pretty simple and this is actually what I typically take personally on a daily basis except for really like the pre-workout I don't do much pre-workout because I'm an absolute coffee addict I drink way too much coffee so I'm not trying to kill myself with caffeine daily and uh, I did actually tell my protein that this is a part of today's video in the diet so they're hooking everybody up I'm gonna link all these in the description description box down below if you want to find each and every single one of them and they're hooking you all up with 55% off for the next 48 hours on your entire order so just use those links and use the discount code ACLVIP at checkout to get 55% off your entire order it is essentially free at that point but anyways guys we have just one scoop of whey protein powder for meal number two again this is just the pre-workout meal even though it's not really a meal but we're gonna be absolutely Absolute savages. He takes all of this, right, individually, I'm sure. But I'm just gonna combine it, okay? Because just gotta be an absolute idiot with these videos. All right, so we're gonna do one scoop of protein powder as the diet calls. And then we're gonna do a scoop of pre-workout. Have you ever taken pre-workout with protein? Comment down below. Boom. And then we're also going to do two scoops, which is one serving of BCAs. I'm sure he just puts this in like a half gallon jug, by the way. But again, I'm a professional idiot. I'm not professional. But I am an idiot. And then we're also going to do, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this. A lot of you are gonna think I'm absolutely insane for this, which I am, but we're gonna put a multivitamin in. Boom! Multivitamin inside the drink. Wow, I'm crazy enough. I was literally about to screw this bottle. There's absolutely no going back from this. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna grow a third arm or I might just have a really, really good workout. We'll see, I'll let you all know. Anyways, let's give this a try. Oh, hey, that's actually really good. Like seriously, that is amazing. <laughs> Wow, that is killer. I think it's a fruity cereal paired up with a ruby red grapefruit pre-workout flavor that for some reason tastes really, really good. Anyways, guys, as I mentioned, take advantage of the 55% off sale if you want to pick any one of these up or anything from myprotein.com, all linked down below. Use that code of CLVIP to save 55% off your order. I'm going to head to the gym, get an epic weight training session, and this just might become my daily routine to combine all of this. Oh, I like feel that pill. Mm. Oh, that was, that was, that was weird. I'll see you all at the gym for an epic workout. No matter whose fault it is that something is broken, if it's your responsibility to fix it.
life, your happiness is your responsibility and your responsibility alone. So I'm gonna be honest with y'all, whey protein powder, pre-workout, BCAs, and multivitamin all mixed in together, most definitely make for an epic workout, can confirm. Anyways, I'm sitting down to meal number three, which is going to be the late lunch, a very late lunch, I'm a little behind schedule here, but this is just gonna call for two cups of steamed broccoli with 10 ounces of cooked chicken breast. However, perfectly cooked chicken breast. Now there's a few wonders in this world that everybody's trying to figure out. Uh, one is like, I don't know who invented coronavirus. Number two is a seal. How do you season your chicken breast? I get this in like every single one of my videos. So all I do is use salt, pepper. Also, here's where it gets a little crazy. Okay, a little, little, little weird. We have some garlic powder, onion powder. All right, it's basic. I'm not gonna lie. But we also have some paprika and some chili powder. That's what gives it like that kick. Like, gah, gah, gah. yeah, tastes good. Anyways, let's go ahead and give this a try. Okay, this is always the make or break moment when you, when you have that first bite of chicken. Juicy. Mmm, banger. On point. Killed it. Thanks, Will. You guys hear that? A seal. A seal. Excuse me. Your chicken is so bland. Where's that coming from? Oh, oh hey there, Mr. Texas Pete. Yeah, sure. Why not just put some of you on top of this? It's so weird. You're conveniently placed right there. Honestly, a very good meal. I forgot how super filling and low calorie something like this can be. However, you don't have to go full bro, even on a bro meal. So let me tell you all a couple tips on how you can make this taste way better with adding very minimal calories. I'm talking about maybe like an extra 20 or 30 cows. So you could put some extremely low sugar, you know, barbecue sauce at the time you're done cooking the chicken breast just to coat it a little bit and make it more flavorful. And you can even toss the broccoli on the pan with a little bit of low sodium soy sauce. That would make it taste so much better so just a few tips there but anyways not gonna knock this down very good very filling she off in the next meal So I just got done preparing the last and final meal in Will Smith's diet, which is going to be his dinner. So check it out. We have got ourselves an eight ounce piece of top sirloin steak and 200 grams of cooked sweet potato. Ladies and gentlemen, if it is one bro meal that I had to choose, which I had to stick with my entire life, and I honestly wouldn't even ever complain about it, it is this, my friends. Steak, I could have it any day of the week. And I'll tell you what, if you ever want to win my heart, just give me a perfectly cooked piece of steak with a glass of Cabernet Sauvignon. Or, I mean, you could be my best friend or something, whatever you wanna be, suits me, but just give me a glass of wine and a nice medium rare cooked piece of steak. I'm all yours, or whatever you want me to be. I don't know what it is, but the combination of sweet potato with steak is just such a killer combo. Honestly, like I could not have rice with steak. This is weird, but sweet potato, good to try. It's gotta be the sweet and savory. Definitely the sweet and savory and a little bit of saltiness. Okay, I'm very curious to know. Let me know in the comment section down below. How do you like your steak cooked? Usually I expect most of you to say medium rare. Maybe medium, maybe, maybe. This is so damn good. If you're wondering what I use to season the steak, just salt and pepper. You don't need anything but salt and pepper, in my opinion, when it comes to a steak. It's already so juicy, especially top sirloin. It has a little bit more fat. Yeah, you definitely don't want to eat like a super lean steak. It's not going to taste good whatsoever, but it's okay. You can tell he made room for this towards the very end of the day because this is the highest calorie content meal, which is placed at the very end with higher fats and a combination of carbs. I think that's because so he stays full throughout the night and like doesn't snack or anything. That's a combination or a tip that I personally use in terms of strategies when I'm dying 
dividing and trying to get shredded. It really does work. So try putting like one of your biggest meals towards the end of the night. I know it sounds scary and weird for most of y'all, but trust me, it'll keep you full and like stop you from thinking about food and snacking at the night, which is one of his biggest downfalls he mentions. Like during quarantine, he said he'd always be picking at the pantry. And something like this is a great strategy when it comes to dieting to stop and eliminate that. <laughs> I wasn't kidding when I said this is the key to my heart. So listen up, the total macros and calories in Will Smith's extreme weight loss diet consisted of 1,742 calories coming from 114 grams of carbs, 63 grams of fat, and 180 grams of protein, which actually makes a lot of sense because he's currently 230 pounds and he's trying to lose 50 pounds to get down to 180. So that protein goal makes a ton of sense. And in general, I like this diet, you know, it's filled with wholesome and filling meals. It's gonna keep you consistent on a calorie deficit is what you need to be on every single day to lose weight. However, I would recommend to Will Smith that he bumps up his calories daily just a little bit, maybe up to like 2100, um, to take his weight loss goals just a little bit slower so he stays consistent with it, never falls off, and it's not as much of a hassle. However, I completely understand why he's taking a faster approach because I do know he's starting a fitness body transformation series with YouTube, so his results have to be more dramatic and over the top, right? I know how it is, brother. But anyways, guys, look, if you are one out of the very many people watching this YouTube video who have fallen off your fitness goals because of the whole COVID lockdown quarantine situation. It's okay, it happens to the best of us. Just know that every single day is a new day to just get back to it. And if you haven't gotten to it yet at all whatsoever, even before COVID or before the whole lockdown situation, what are you doing, man? It feels so freaking good to be fit, to be healthy, to be muscular, to be lean, and just to feel good about yourself and how you look and the way you feel. I mean, it doesn't matter if you're Will Smith or Joe Schmo, okay? Everyone can agree with that, and I would love to help you out. So if you do need help with your fitness goals, just make sure you check out my Complete Body Transformation Program. I'll link it second thing in the description box down below. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this as much as I had fun filming it. If you did, just make sure you smash the like button. Let us run this video up. Destroy the like button right now. Tell your mom, tell your dad, just do it yourself, man. I really do appreciate it. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new. Hit the notification bell right next to the subscribe button to become a homie, knowing I upload every Monday and Wednesday. And of course, following on Instagram, at Asil Sway. There's many of you that don't, just so you know what I'm up to um, every single day. I'm posting on my stories with lots of helpful diet training tips. So you definitely don't wanna miss out. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see every single one of you in the next video. Cheers to the squad, the sweet squad. Who's hit to the dark horse cab, by the way? Freaking killer. Man, it's cheap.